Greetings, folks. Perry here. This is the Let's Play of Civilization V. Um, playing, starting one of these right now. Uh, combination of kind of having wet my whistle with Keb. Um, last couple of, of Let's Plays we've done. Kind of reawakened my enjoyment of the game, and the uh, by and large. And then I'm super psyched for Civ Six coming up here shortly. So it's kind of a way to see if I can bomb one of these out before I get uh, before Six comes out and the world gets inundated. So. Ten civs on a large map. That's normal. I'm picking random. Half the regular number of city states, just because I prefer the. Re I'd rather get the barbarians in the open land, and city states are kind of meh. Uh, unless I'm Austria, at which point I'll regret this. Resources are abundant. Playing on Prince difficulty. Yeah, yada yada. Let's see what we get. Honor be with you, oh great hero Gaia Mada, Prime Minister of Mayapit. And unifier of the Indonesian archipelago. The stories Different. of your heroism on the battlefield are bested only by the legends of your sworn oath to unite the far flung islands of Indonesia under one banner. Serving your queen and empire with loyalty, you not only strove to fulfill your oath and conquered any who stood in your path, but you succeeded in capturing what was then the entirety of the known archipelago, the first to unite what is today. Modern Indonesia. First three cities founded Mighty on continents Maria other than Gahamada. your people in my home provide two unique luxury resources. To prosperity. So whales, two whale, maybe a third one there. Pearls, lots of sheep, river, river, distant wheat, but. Ruins, marble, stone. Let's research. Um, only want Stonehenge for a change. I don't normally get to build it, so you'll go that way. We'll see what we'll do. I'll probably end up with like Attila or something like that on my continent and get destroyed, but it'll be fun while it lasts. Hey, I'll take a second population this early in the game. And a second ruin. Not sure what that says of the desert up here that they, uh, Bit of a map. I'll keep following the coastline. Well, I'm liking the mountains. Give a little bit more variety in the topography. I mean, they're utterly useless from a city's perspective, but. Utterly useless from a city's perspective. Use production, and we'll do another scout. We'll keep just mm, seeing what we're seeing while we're seeing. Oh, I'll turn off the resources. Oh, no, at the yield. There we go. It's useful to know, but I was curious for the initial city placement. And as that is taken care of, we can move on. Now, my normal civ luck will dictate me running into another civilization probably within about two turns. Potentially build a uh, canal city down there. Use production, monument. Definitely putting the city at that point. The Sri Prada, Prada, that's. Definitely worth bringing cities that direction too. Shall the clay say pottery?
Thou hey, that animal husband. The ox when he tread. Horny culture. This has been a nice start so far. I know there's no actual like walkway there, but it's still worth going and checking. Mm, citrus. need a worker yet. And I have a continent to myself. Now I just need to bring my stuff down and uh, start watching for, uh, I'll start getting rid of some of the shadows to watch for barbarians. I was worried about. Stop policy. Choose production. Just because I've got a large continent that will generate barbarians, I will get a little extra combat potential there. Heck, you know, that's mountain? Okay. So be it. So be it, Union. You can live there. Now, the fundamental rule of Civ 5 means I'm going to lack iron and probably also coal, just to spite me. Because why have either of those? So teach us... Please research. Where do I want to go next? Got calendar. Want quarries next. The nice part about parts of this continent is I've got choke points. Choose production.
Do do do. Anyway, yeah, Hendra's right. You can sleep with the fishies there. Cross to there. Well, let's see. Actually, change production. We need a worker. That's also a mountain. Interesting to see. Heal to full. Or heal sort of full. Actually, I should go keep an eye on my southern borders. Yep. Run away, little scout. Run the hell away. The meek shall inherit. I can found a pantheon. Uh, what do I want? Don't have wine and incense. Don't really have any overwhelming amount of rare goods. Um, got a natural wonder, though. You don't take that one. Um, so I can build... Citrus and wheat. I've got a wheat. Wheat, citrus, bananas. Plus one faith from desert tiles. There's a lot of desert on this continent, so I think we will go with the desert folklore. I think the culture from shrines is nice. Oh, decisions. Hmm. Top policy. And 
we press on it? Juice production. Really want to get building that, but I'll stick with Warrior. Let's see. One, two. I build it there, I get to that real easily. Back to tile yields. Yeah, these won't do much. Yeah, this area up here is just brutal, so I will bring back down here and take advantage of. River Valley, you know these orders. Turn off yield icons. You will see there. You will press on to the south next turn. Choose production. production. <sighs> Worker would be nice. Population would be nice. Uh, we don't I'm behind where I want to be, but oh well. How happy are we?
Next one. Really already to to the, the barbarian galleys? That's that's rude. That is flippin' rude. Choose production. Now suddenly I've got too many to build. I'm going to be cutting that a little close. I'm so forgot to shoot him. Oops, my bad. He who. Let's research. Bye. Two use production. A shrine.
Someone's already in class. Two are already in. Library's already in. Wow, I am behind. Even when I'm not playing, Kib. I am behind. Bit of a nuisance. Uh, part of the curtain, it's kind of scary. Research runs working. Well, this is a good place to stop this. I mean, we've got the first several thousand years out of the way. I'm about to run out of money. So thanks for watching, folks, and uh, we'll pick this up next time.